like, right. ah! <laughs> The Valiant is a squad-based RTS set in the 13th century, where you play through the story of Theodoric von Ackenberg, a member of the Knights Templar who gets called back into action after a period of disillusionment. And it's a really rich strategy game, a great historical action adventure title, especially if you're a fan of history. But what we're most interested in is the Last Man Standing three player co op mode, which is a wave based defend the cart mode. That is quite a challenge. Now, I'm playing with two of my colleagues who've been told that they are going to be joining a play session with uh, an expert in medieval combat. Uh, in reality, it's just me in a stupid costume, but I have taken my role as the historical expert quite seriously. I've got my costume and I'm armed with a smattering of historical facts about the Knights Templar Order, which I'm going to furnish my colleagues with over the course of the session. Let's see how we get on. Right, boys, I've been asked to join you to play some of The Valiant, which is about the Knights <laughs> Templar. Have I interrupted something, Connor? <laughs> If you are reacting to my attire, I've been asked to wear this to denote myself as the historical expert that's going to guide you through the experience of uh, defending pilgrims in the Holy Land, while also furnishing you with regular facts about the Knights Templar. And I'm taking my role seriously, Connor, uh, and I hope you will as well. That's all I'm going to say about the subject for now. Right, boys, we are now, uh, we're about to play some Valiant, which is about the Knights Templar running around the Holy Land, swinging swords, throwing bombs, and uh, doing magic spells. <laughs> <laughs> Area effect spells on uh, on hordes of, of enemies in order to defend the pilgrims in the whole. That's what they used to, stop laughing, Connor, that's what they used to do, right? That The whole point of the Knights Templar was they, they were basically travel agents, right? Yeah. For Europeans going to visit the Temple of Solomon, and that's where they got their name from. All right. So, what we're doing is we're defending carts. You know, EasyJet holidays, right? Yeah. yeah. EasyJet. You go on the app and you book a trip to Portugal or whatever. That's what we are, except the Middle Ages, right? Yeah. Yep. And we've, we've got to facilitate that by uh, doing some, some combat here now. <laughs> Yeah. Who are we fighting? Like, what sort of people do we fight? Unspecified bandits. Which one of you is the archer? I'm the archer. That's right. Me. So you're right, right. You stand at the back and hit people with the bow and arrow, right? Gotcha. Where are the baddies? Uh, on the left and right. I, I think. can't tell who's who, yeah? Oh, I think they're burning one of our caravans. But well, what are they doing that for? They look like Knights Hospitaller, which was a, a rival order who ran hospitals right the thing is all these knights were monastic right they were a monastic order so they they maintained monasteries on the pilgrim trail to the holy land right so when you see a knight's templar on the telly being all heroic or whatever in films and that mm. what you got to remember is that they are chased as in virgins not as in running away that probably explains why they're so angry with us for no reason this is my point they were probably frustrated all the time and if you think about it, having their carts burnt is the least of their worries. Right, we've got horses. Horses now. So in terms of the historical aspect of, like, horses yeah. in the Crusades, like, what was the deal of those? Well, they would sit on the back of them, Connor, and ride them around the place. And I'm, I'm casting a, a power here, which causes a field effect to reduce the damage of enemy units, right? Nice. And I think back in the day, what they would have done was uh, they would have greased up a pig and set it on fire. Gotcha and released it into the battlefield, which would have terrified the enemy into submission. Our left side card is being... Uh, is there another... Oh, oh fuck, second. crying out loud. Co Connor! Oh, I'm dead. Uh, I am also dead. I am soon to be dead. It's not going well, is it, boys? No. You know, until they pissed off the King of France, the Templars were the most powerful order on the planet and the richest. They were so rich, they used to lend money to the royal families of Europe. That's how rich they were. That's wild. Where did they get oh, all that money from? Uh, pilgrims. They would charge pilgrims for plates of soup and that. Right. Luc lucrative trade, apparently. <laughs> and they also invented the modern banking system, as I've mentioned. So the, the idea was that pilgrims, uh, it could be an 18-month round trip to the Holy Land and back. And obviously, back then, you didn't want to carry all your coins with you in a big rucksack. Mm. So the Knights Templar came up with a system where you would go to your local branch, 
of the Templars and deposit a big bag of money and they would give you a credit note, right? Mm. Right. And when you got to the Temple of Solomon at the other end, you would present your credit note. I promise to pay the bearer, blah, blah, blah. And they would uh, furnish you with your coins at the other end. So you could, you could go on sightseeing tours of uh, Jerusalem or whatever. I don't know exactly what they did back there in terms of tourism, but I imagine it'd be something like that. Oh, so sort of like an ATM. Yeah. So they invented the modern banking system, which is currently collapsing. I cannot believe he's got me doing this. <laughs> Sorry, I'm laughing. Right, Connor, yes. I think the reason we keep failing is because of your attitude, frankly, right? I wasn't going to say anything oh. in front of Sharif. So the carts are producing our power-ups that we need to uh, replenish mm. our life and uh, get speed boosts and stuff like that, right? So when they set fire to the carts, we got to be on that, really, haven't we? Yes. Like these boys here now. You can use a condemnation ability. Condemnation retribution, yeah. Right? God's getting involved and saying, right, you're doing 30% less damage now because you're an infidel. Connor? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm on it, I'm on it, I'm on it, I'm on it. I've been shooting tons of arrows. Concentrate now, right? What does that mortar and pestle do? I'm going to find out. The mortar and pestle, it restores 50% of your health and fortitude. Ooh, lovely. In fact, it's better than that because it's not just you. I can go up behind you here. Yeah. And I can give you my herbs that I picked up earlier. There we go. See, it's really healed you up. Oh, well, that is lovely. Uh, I don't want to jinx it, but I feel like we're doing better now, boys. I feel like we are uh, working as a team. Oh, well, no, actually, no, because now the horses are here. So, oh, being charged up. I used to like horses when I was a child. What's that? What happened? Why don't you like them anymore? Well, because of this. Yeah, now. What Thank I you. quite like about this is the distribution of powers. Yes, yeah. so you've got retribution, condemnation, shield bash. <laughs> You All equal in the eyes of God. You can only ask God for so much, really. You know, at some point, you've really got to start. You've got to just help yourself at some point, haven't you? You've got to pull yourself up by your bootstraps. I'm neck in tonics, yeah, boys. Oh, no, you have to... Okay, so you see the wheel on your bottom right. You have to click the uh, item. I thought I was drinking the potions. Apparently, I was just redistributing them. How very Marxist of you. Quite socialist, isn't it? It wasn't invented back then. They did have a grain allowance in the Roman times, though, which is a sort of early form of welfare system. Mm. I spend a lot of time listening to the History of Rome podcast by Mike Duncan. Oh, I'm dead. That's a good podcast, that, by the way. We seem to have been overrun again. Okay, so I guess, yeah, you do get some XP. You just grind this out for a little bit. In a way, this kind of represents the uh, arduous nature of running some, this, this sort of primordial medieval Ryanair. I mean, it was hard back then. They didn't have proper shoes or anything. No. They would have been marching on uh, hard cork boards that their dads would have nailed into their feet. So we seem to be in some sort of man-made encampment here. So how were these built back in the day? Ah, uh, well, they would have gotten loads of wood and stuck it together with nails and stuff. Really? Yeah, they were really clever back then. Why have they got fists on their head? What's happening? Because I uh, taunted them. What were some insults, sort of taunting gestures you could do back then? Insults, taunts and gestures. Well, if you were a Knights Templar, you would have probably just sort of shouted the word infidel a lot. God punch. That thinned the crowd a little bit. I've got a throwing axe. We're doing much better than before. Much better. We carry this on. We'll be able to level up in about six months, I think. This elite squad is really... Oh, who are these boys? Bloody hell. Yeah, this is the one I was talking about. Let's finish the archers, I guess. Yeah, take these out first. And then we can focus all on nice. the uh, elite. Maybe that was a mistake. Okay, we seem to have done pretty good. Um, I think now is a good opportunity while we're just fighting this guy as well, if there are any herbs around. Yeah. Don't tell me these guys have retribution as well. Yeah. God's playing both sides, yeah? Doesn't look like there's any cavalry, which is good. Yeah, we're doing better for sure. That's wave four. We've got 116 XP. Won't be able to level up this week. Oh, the cart's nearly gonna go. I think we just about saved it. I think we can get you up as well. Can you do that? We're still in the game, boys. We're still in the game. Okay, I can get you up. You need a heal ASAP. Quickly yes. grab like a top. There'll be a tonic to spawn soon, and some herbs. We got one. How many carts we got left? We got all three cuts. We got all three cuts. Well, we're doing all right then, are we? Yeah. yeah. This is, and, and the burn meter. There's like, there's like a red, wait, there's like a red bar on me. I think oh. I'm being targeted by the... Uh, we have an elite... They west. got laser sights now. <laughs> <laughs> I desperately need to get a tonic, so I'm going to run. Oh, you f... <laughs> medieval... This may be us. This may be uh, it. I'll try to run for a tonic. 
200 XP though, boys. Not bad. Nice. Brilliant, 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 brilliant. Okay, one more. Little bit disconcerting that you are both doing a lot better while I'm dead. Yeah, keep Sharif alive because he's doing all the work. <laughs> no, I'm keeping him alive. There's going to be a valiant God. death here, but... Can uh, I get you up in time, maybe? Hang oh. on. Oh. Some... oh, waiting for players. What's the historical precedence for this? What happened? What What's the historical precedent for one of us having a power cut? Right, Sharif's disappeared. <laughs> <laughs> Sharif buggered off and left us to our own devices, but it's I've all right. Died. It's just you. It's one just me. Well, if it's just me, we're dead, aren't we? But, I mean, <laughs> what a game. 200 XP that time. That's not bad. We've got to wave five. I was just saying, I'm going to go back to Theodoric. Oh, yeah. And switch to sticky bombs. What do you think the sticky bombs are made of? Glue. Oh, oh we're back at the... Oh, I f***ing hate this harbour. <laughs> I don't even like maritime life. I don't even like harbours. I don't like waterfronts. I avoid them. Shots down. Retribution. Oh, we uh, made short work of them horses, didn't we? I think we're getting better at this. Mm -hmm. I don't know how. How far have we got? Wave five. Wave five's the furthest we've got, isn't it? Yeah. Mm. I would grab these healing stuff as soon as they come. There you go, that should heal you up nicely. Okay. This brown trousers time now. Oh, there's hundreds again. of them. There's hundreds of them now. Right. That's right. We, we're looking a bit better health-wise than we were before. So Yes. We are, yeah. Oh, there's a, a load of bastards moves. that have just charged at me. That's great. They're about to go. I feel like we've gotten to wave five much quicker than before. No, we're doing a good job. Oh, Here we go. This, this is where we got up to last time. He's got his ACOG M40 on us. Taking out these spearmen over in the south. You're doing a great job keeping aggro. Nice. Okay, we're coming to help. Uh, come on, help. We're going to do it, I think. Oh! What? Oh, that's we must quick. have... Um, that's a stealth bomb thing. So I think they're over here by me. Oh, yeah. oh, oh the elite. Do you see the elites uh, then? Shimmering into life? Yeah, so they have the same abilities we have. So that's my... That's their I, set trap. Well, I well, I frankly don't like that. <laughs> I think they've got an unfair advantage if they can do what we can do. Right, are we just going to have to get stuck in now because they're the only ones, aren't they? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll pepper them down. It's all good. It's quite simple now. It's just literally just keep on hitting these lads. All right, and then they... Oh, crap. Right, And then crap. they should disappear. Crap, crap, they're going to run. Uh, have we lost our carts? Because... No, 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 no. They, just, they have a limit of how much they can give out per wave. Uh, right. Wave six. Wave six? <laughs> well, go, I've got horses on me now. Great. But a divine retribution. Oh, I think... Oh, I'm die, dead. Jim. I'm dead. Ah, oh, you that's the, the, dead twice now. I only got a crossbowman now. Oh, no. Just for the viewers at home, a crossbow is like a medieval equivalent of an AK-47. Yeah. yeah. Look at this. It's still, look, that, those horsemen, those priests on horseback, are sending out a live healing beam to nearby. Oh. They've got healing auras. Well, last cheating, they didn't have microwave healing beams in the Middle Ages. That's really hard. Okay, well, wave six. A telescopic healing beam. <laughs> Christ. How are you supposed to win against that kind of superior technology? Oh, I leveled up. The only one who didn't was you, Jim. How come I didn't level up? I only died twice. Unbelievable. Right, I am extremely proud of us, boys, because uh, as we've seen in the Valiant, defending carts from being set on fire uh, in the Holy Land was, in fact, uh, a very difficult thing to do. And uh, we didn't get past wave six, but I think that's very good going given the fact that we're idiots, really, aren't we? Yeah. So thank you very much. That was a wonderful experience, but I don't want to see either of you ever again. Nothing personal. Hmm. <laughs> right. It's... We had a history expert, <laughs> and they're not here. Oh God. All right, so you've got me in a joke shop costume. Uh, How did you even... Where'd you get that from? Amazon. <laughs> wow. There, was, there wasn't Good. a great, like, I, I didn't go for a fitting or anything.